for joining me. Welcome back to your Express Weekend Reading. Okay, you've got one of three groups to choose from, group one, group two, group three, that's rose quartz, clear quartz or amethyst. Take a moment to see which one suits you best today and I'll be back with your reading. Welcome back group one, if you've selected the rose quartz then this is your reading. For your express reading today, this is a group reading, not a one-on-one, -on -one, so it will resonate differently for different people. What I'm getting for you is quite some bright, positive cards for you for the weekend. I feel like it's time to get out and explore, um, road trip, get out in nature. I'm also seeing the sunshine card, so get out and have some fun in the sun is what it's saying. This is your fun joy card, so it's saying get out and have some fun in the sun. That's if you have sun in your area. If not, it's just saying get out and have fun. Just go out and have fun. It's also saying there's an element of um, protecting your energy, and, and what I'm getting from that is that you need to have some fun to build your energy to in, to boost your energy and raise your vibration because what I'm getting is that it's saying protect your energy and I think that having the two bright cards on each side is saying that you need to um, have the fun enjoy also the sun to um, boost your energy is what I'm getting and even getting out in the sun too if you can't get out on a road trip or if you can't get out and have fun or do something um, explore it's saying you need to get some sunlight so sunlight to protect your energy um, I hope that's going to restore your your aura store your energy sun is very good for you it's vitamin d so it's saying that you need to get out and get some sun or get out fresh air get out in nature get out and enjoy do the things you enjoy go visit people you you love go and do something fun and and i, I feel like that's going to protect your energy so where you may have had a busy or a stressful week if you just can go and let go and relax that's really going to help you it's going to protect your whole body actually your physical body as well um, so I hope that helps I'll be back in next Monday for your full reading this is just your express reading thank you for joining me Welcome back group two. If you've selected the clear quartz, then this is your reading. What I'm picking up out of your reading is it's asking you to recharge for health. Um, I'm feeling you're, like with your cards, there's a, there is a bit of chaos around you. I'm getting, um, it's saying be calm in the chaos and it's asking to pull your energies back from whatever chaos or drama is going on around you. Uh, pull your, yourself back and restore for your own well-being. So you need to be calm. You need to find a calm place. You need to put your, your mind in a calm place. If you can't get out and get away from it, then take five minutes take 10 15 20 minutes to um, close your eyes and go within go and be calm you need to be calm it's, it's kind of like an escapism it's like I'm feeling like you're needing to um, for your own well-being it's saying you need to find some kind of relaxation or some kind of calmness so if you can't get that you can't get out and get away from it then you need to go within to get it so one way or another you're needing to um, to go and get that calmness and that relaxation because that's the two prominent cards in this reading you also have the card of assistance now you have the card of um, the pegasus so pegasus is um, so it's coming in from another dimension it can be um, this is more of a spiritual thing so it could be more um, like your spirit guides or your spirit team here to help you uh, just remove that always wearing those on my wrist um, so yeah your spirit team could be coming in to um, either give you a download is what I'm getting that, that could be the other thing you could be receiving downloads um, but you need to be in a very and this is not for everybody definitely not for everybody this is only for some of you but I feel like in order to receive the and again I'm getting it because this is the card of the trumpet and trumpet is somebody sending messages and it can be like a very spiritual or a religious thing so I feel like yeah you're in order for you to pick up on those downloads that, could, that are around you at the moment to come in you need to put yourself in a very relaxed calm space to be able to pull in those downloads now those downloads could be um, they could come in the form of dreams they could come in the form of just thoughts or ideas or inspiration motivation um, it could also be something for you personally some guidance for you because this is also a guidance card it's called assistance um, a, a guidance to push you on the right path help you along your path um, give you some great ideas help you with whatever problems that's going on around you so it can be a very personal thing those downloads downloads can also be um, some something that you're meant to give to other people it could be messages for other people that you're meant to give you could be a good receiver a, good, a very good conduit um, a receiver of messages so I'm feeling like yeah there's definitely some kind of messages come in coming in could also be for some of you on a physical letter, uh, level, you're going to hear some kind of message. There's some kind of new message or something you're receiving. And by that, I mean you might hear some new news. Some news might be coming in. So there's a, yeah, there's a bit here, but the general overall energy of this spread is that you need to find calm. You need to find a place of 
um, relaxation and calmness for you to either restore your energy uh, or to receive the messages or the downloads that all the answers actually could be just straightforward like answers in order for you to receive whatever answer you're looking for I feel like you're going within to get it you're either tapping in to your own higher self or your own connection but I feel like yeah you're needing to put yourself in a very calm place to do that calm relaxed balanced state of mind to be able to bring in those answers and it's answers for you or it's answers for other people so thank you for joining me group two i'll be back with your reading on monday for your full reading thank you for joining me group three if you've selected the amethyst then this is your reading okay so in the center of your spread this is your express mini reading so it's for your weekend uh, it's a group reading not a one-on-one -on -one, so it's going to resonate differently for different people but I will give you the overall energy of the spread now what I'm picking up first of all is um, you've got the blessings card in the middle so whatever direction you take whatever way you go it's saying you've got the blessings of the universe um, all around you so it's it's saying go go with God is what I'm actually hearing um, not everybody's religious but I'm but I'm hearing the words go with God so um, it, it's just saying go with your go with your inner guidance um, go go with whatever force or um, it's like a feeling of being pushed or being motivated or being it's like I'm, I'm feeling like the universe is pushing me. That's that's the way I'm. That's the way I'm getting it. The universe is pushing me. Things are falling into place to do a certain thing or go a certain direction. I'm getting a push from the universe. So it's saying go go with that universal flow. Go with the flow. Go with the flow. The universal flow is what I'm what I'm getting for you there. Now I feel like because there's a um, there's a crossroads coming up for you, and I feel like it can be it could be related to that. So it's like a um, a crossroads. You're coming up to a point in your life where there's um, a crossroads. So it's where you're getting to decide what your next steps are, what your next adventure is, what your next path is, or it's like a crossroads. It's where, where you can take a different direction. Um, change, it can also bring changes, but I feel like it's just like a little bit of a, um, I don't feel like it's major changes. I'm not seeing any chaos or anything here or any change cards, and it is only a mini spread. But what I'm getting is that you're coming up to some kind of crossroads in your path um, at the moment, and you need, you, you're very, guided by the universe to go a certain way so whatever way feels like it's the most flowing the way that lined up easiest or the way that it feels easiest to go then that's the direction you need to go um, okay I'm also getting here that you're needing to be seen so something either about your social media um, or it's something about being seen so it's, it's saying be seen socials is the name of the card so it's saying um, and again I'm seeing also the big orange sun or the big sun and when I'm drawn to when I see that is um, like God again because it's like Ra, like um, Egyptian Ra was their sun god. So again, I'm feeling you're very. It's all. It's all a very universal thing for you. So it's a. You're very guided by the universe or got by God or by your higher self, however you prefer to to view this, because um, this is unique for each person. But what I am I'm drawing again in this card also to saying that the universe or God or whatever it is there that your beliefs your source um, whatever it is is guiding you and there's lots of stars around this card as well so that's making me think too that there's lots of blessings so two cards with lots of blessings and lots of stars around you so I feel like yeah it's saying whatever it is that's on your mind at the moment or inspiration that you're receiving it's coming from God it's coming from source it's coming from the universe so it's saying go for it whatever this crossroads is that you're up to it's saying it is it's blessed it's a blessed path so yeah definitely go ahead and, and take that path what a beautiful reading for you group three I will be back with your full reading on Monday